The Bad Guys is an animated film by DreamWorks. Um, now, I didn't know much about this movie. I think I saw the trailer in theaters. It didn't look very interesting. They just played Billy Eilish's song over and over. But this is a really interesting, fun film. It is in it can be described as a Lupin the Third meets Zootopia. A little bit of Pulp Fiction sprinkled in there. It is about the bad guys. They are a crew of criminals. There's Mr. Wolf, the uh, charming uh, leader. And then there's Shark, the master of disguise. Uh, Webbs, the tarantula hacker. Uh, there's Mr. Snake, the... Uh, I don't know what he is. He's I guess he's like a... He uses his body to get into tight spaces, so he's kind of like a point man. And then there's also Mr. Piranha, the hot-headed um, brawler guy who, who's also like a disguised person, I guess. Anyways, the five of them have a big reputation for stealing anything that moves. And uh, after their latest heist, they are challenged by the governor when she announces that there's going to be a special Golden Dolphin Award given to the, the best Samaritan in the city. Uh, Professor Marmalade, so they decide to rob the uh, gala. However, they end up getting captured, and a bet is formed in which Professor Marmalade will try to um, rehabilitate them. And uh, now the plot's really predictable. I could easily guess the entire plot ahead of time, not a big deal, but the movie has a lot of charms to make up for its pre predictability. Uh, first off, great voice acting. They pick a lot of different people, lesser known people, that really get into the, the groove. I noticed Mr. Piranha kind of sounded like Kevin Hart, but it wasn't him. So I'm glad they didn't just, you know, dump him in there and try to get the cloud. I don't like it when animated movies use too popular of a celebrity and they don't use someone for their voice. I don't really like that. Uh, the animation is great. It's very similar to um, Into the Spider-Verse, kind of comic booky. Also, the humor is really great. The um, crime thriller elements borrows from other crime thriller stories. Um, the movie has a lot of charm, good characters, good arcs, uh, good twists. Uh, I really enjoyed this one. I wasn't expecting a lot because, you know, I just... The trailers just kept pumping bad guy at you. So, but this is a really fun movie and I enjoyed it. So I give uh, The Bad Guys a 7 out of 10.